Let's go on. Hi, everybody. I know uh, I'm new to this community, and I want to thank everybody for accepting me. I had my exact city just recently, so I don't fully really understand everything it means to be disabled yet. I'm learning, and I appreciate the time and the effort that everyone takes to inform me of what I need to do and to move further. <laughs> thank you, sir. What I am here to talk about is that I would like to see, and we are all very aware, that we are a need for change. Um, Obviously, that is coming, and but it is up to the individual, such as yourself, to make it happen, just like it's up to each and every individual to take charge of their life, to take responsibility for themselves, and to seek information and try to move forward in life. I realize that uh, there's so much information out there, it's kind of hard what to believe and what to see, but the truth of the matter is, because the system has so much red tape, some people give up. Some people find it hard to move forward and just kind of idle or allow the system to take charge. And it's really up to the individuals to make a difference in themselves and within their community. Um, we all know coming November there's going to be serious change. And uh, I know who I'm voting for, but uh, I inspire everybody that they get out to the polls and they do what it takes to make that change and make that effort. There's a thing called, as you can see from my t-shirt, there's a thing called stem cell research. And they, you know, everybody wanted to shut this program down because they were using fetal stem cells. But that is no longer the case. They do use adult stem cells, which is, comes from your own body. And if you utilize one of the tools that they have for you, you have the world's largest library now, like the Library of Alexandria, and that is the internet. And if you research yourself and take time and look forward to the new things that are emerging within the research, you'll find it's very, very interesting, and not to mention it's going to do something. It's going to cure, not treat. And that is the main thing that I'm very obsessed with and passionate about, is that I want, I want cures. I don't want treatments anymore. I've seen enough things in this uh, community to know that there are cures out there. And I'm sure you want cures, just as bad as I do. And here's a fact for you. There's not been a single major cure in our country since 1955. And that cure was polio. And I think our, our technology, uh, beakers and testings are a little better than they were back in 1955. So it's about time that the government, and it's about time that our communities and the corporations get behind us and start making some changes. Again, I thank you so much for your time, your efforts, and um, I hope to see more and be a little bit more responsive in the future. Thank you. Excuse me, man. About the clothes line. Yeah. Excuse me, sweetheart. Yo, 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 y